Welcome to our story about the mysterious disappearance of the Vikings in Greenland. In the late 10th century, a group of Norsemen, led by Eric the Red, set out from Iceland and discovered a land they called Greenland. They established settlements and thrived there for several centuries, despite the harsh climate and remote location. But by the early 15th century, the Viking settlements in Greenland had vanished, and their fate remains a mystery to this day. We will take a look at the evidence and theories surrounding the disappearance of the Vikings in Greenland and explore the possible reasons why one of history's most resilient and resourceful peoples ultimately failed to survive in this harsh land. The Vikings were known for their seafaring skills and their ability to colonize new lands. They had previously established settlements in Iceland and Ireland and were seeking new lands to conquer. In 985 AD, Eric the Red, a Norse explorer, discovered a land to the west of Iceland that he called Greenland. He claimed that the land was green and fertile and would be a great place for a settlement. He led a group of settlers to Greenland, and over the next few centuries, they established two main settlements, the Eastern Settlement and the Western Settlement. The Eastern Settlement was the larger of the two, with around 3,000 inhabitants at its peak. The settlement was located near the coast making it easy for the Vikings to fish and trade with other Norse settlements in Iceland and Europe. The Vikings in the eastern settlement built farms, homes, and churches, and developed a unique style of architecture known as the Greenlandic style. This style of architecture featured turf-covered houses, which were better insulated against the cold and the wind than traditional wooden houses. The western settlement, on the other hand, was located further inland and had a much smaller population of around 500 people. It was less accessible than the eastern settlement and was therefore less developed. The western settlement was mostly used for hunting and fishing, and the people living there had a more nomadic lifestyle. The Vikings in Greenland were able to survive in a harsh climate and a remote location due to their ingenuity and resourcefulness. They raised livestock, hunted and fished, and traded with other Norse settlements. They also developed a unique style of agriculture called Norse pasture where they used the land for grazing animals rather than farming. The Vikings in Greenland thrived for several centuries. They were able to survive in a harsh climate, in a remote location, due to their ingenuity and resourcefulness. But by the early 15th century, the settlements were abandoned and the Vikings had disappeared. There are several theories as to why the Vikings in Greenland disappeared. The most popular theory is that a cooling climate made it increasingly difficult for them to grow crops and raise livestock. The Little Ice Age, a period of cooling that began in the 14th century, may have made it impossible for the Vikings to survive in Greenland. The colder climate would have led to shorter growing seasons, making it harder to grow crops and raising livestock. This would have led to a shortage of food and ultimately the abandonment of the settlements. Another theory is that the Vikings overexploited their resources. The Vikings cleared large areas of land for farming, which led to soil erosion and made it harder to grow crops. They also hunted and fished to the point of exhaustion, which led to a decline in their food supply. Finally, there is a theory that the Inuit people, who also lived in Greenland, may have played a role in the disappearance of the Vikings. The Inuit people were skilled hunters and fishers, and they may have competed with the Vikings for resources. This competition may have led to conflicts between the two groups, which could have contributed to the decline of the Viking settlements. In conclusion, the disappearance of the Vikings in Greenland remains a mystery. Climate change, overexploitation of resources, and conflicts with the Inuit people are all possible reasons for the decline of the settlements. But one thing is certain. The Vikings in Greenland were able to survive and thrive in a harsh climate for several centuries. Their disappearance is a reminder of the fragility of human civilization and how our actions can have a profound impact on our environment and on the people around us.